Impact Wrestling presents Against All Odds. Live June 9th on Impact Plus and Fight. Well, Dirty Dango clearly fed up with what he sees here in the Impact locker room, and especially Joe Hendry. Ladies and gentlemen, the following contest set for one fall. Introducing first, accompanied to the ring by the Indian Lion Shira from Mumbai, India, Champagne Shane. Tomorrow, Retro Night on Access TV is alive and kicking at 8 p.m. Eastern, starting with the very, very best of the 80s, then it's the monkeys, then it's nothing but trailers. Flashback. Don't miss Retro Night here on Access TV. But there is nothing retro about Champagne Singh and Shira. They are the now, they are the future as Singh heads into battle here. Champagne Singh and Shira. At one point, we're backing up the Impact World Champion, Steve Macklin. Shira and Singh assaulted Heath before Rhino's Impact World title oh, shot against baby. Macklin weeks ago. His opponent from Fort Mill, South Carolina, Heath. And Heath has certainly not forgotten about that. Wanted this match, wanted a semblance of revenge. Unfortunately, he does not have Rhino here to back him up like Singh as Shira. There was a number of weeks ago that Rhino was preparing for an Impact World title match against Steve Macklin. Before the match got underway, Singh and Shira assaulted Heath in the backstage area. Heath, of course, the longtime tag team championship partner of Rhino. That clearly was in the mind of Rhino, and then how things played out, no one could have seen coming. Macklin dismantled Rhino, put him in the hospital, assaulting the previously surgically repaired left knee of Rhino. Right, he thought about business right now. And speaking of business, we hope you'll join us in Memphis, Tennessee at the Soundstage at Graceland for Mid-South Mayhem on Friday, September 22nd and Saturday the 23rd. Tickets are on sale now at impactwrestling.com. And Heath has been dying for this ever since the aforementioned Ooh. match between Rhino and Macklin. But Heath has got a lot on his mind because tomorrow night and against all odds, he's a part of the 8-4-1 match that'll determine the number one contender to the Impact World Championship come Slammiversary. That match will start as an eight-man tag team bout, and the winning team will immediately square off in a four-way with one winner to be determined. Oh! Our first time ever matchup there. New concept. Gonna be a little bit of a war of attrition there with everybody involved. But right now, the Indian Lion, Shira getting himself involved. Oh, and boom! I'm doing enough there to provide an opening for Singh. The official was preventing Singh from doing anything further. Oh. Didn't see Shira's initial involvement. Now the leg sent into the bottom rope. No, no, no. You see Champagne Singh here now oh. leading by example. Think about the irony here that they're assaulting the left knee of Heath and it was the left knee of Rhino that was decimated by Macklin. Shut up, loser! They know that they're deadly when they get a focused target through Singh and Shira. And now Singh in firm control of Heath oh. here. And tomorrow night at Against All Odds, the teams will be as such initially in the 8-4-1 match. It'll be Bully Ray, Jonathan Gresham. Oh, cover here from Singh. Kick out by Heath. Plus Heath and Nick Aldis on the same team. They'll have to battle Moose, Mike Bailey back here on Impact, plus Rich Swan and PCO. And as I mentioned, it starts as an eight-man tag. It breaks down. The winning team becomes a four-way match. Every man for himself. And then the winner gets an Impact World title shot. And that's why our main event still to come this evening, Moose and and Rich Swan against Gresham and Nick Aldis is so important because there's just so many layers to what can happen in a match like this. That's right in our main event. Later tonight, they're gonna have to coexist as a team, obviously tonight in the main event, but then those members will also be on the same side in the eight-man tag portion of the matchup at against a lot. So they have to find a way to build some kind of chemistry. Oh before it all breaks down, ultimately in the 8-4-1. You're a former tag team champion. I mean, who do you trust? I, I, I don't know, because you ultimately know you're going to end up fighting somebody oh. on your own team. It's a very strange, it's a very layered dynamic there. I can't wait to see how it all breaks down. But right now, it's Heath who's looking to break down. Sing! Wake up call! Heath, into the cover! Heath with momentum, heading towards against the tomorrow night. Here is 
the winner, Heath. Can Heath become the number one contender to the Impact World title at Slammiversary? We'll find out tomorrow night at Against the Lawns in Columbus, Ohio.